These passive income nodes earn five tokens a day and the project has a fully public team and over five and a half million dollars in funding. They already have an active product that is competing with Zoom and Google Meets. It's an audio and video conferencing product that is going to rely on nodes to run the project. These nodes go on sale today and there are still tier one spots. Make sure you stay till the end of the video as I'll show you how to buy one even if you live in the US. In this video, I'll do a brief intro to Huddle01. I'll talk about the media nodes, the requirements, and the bonus offers that they have at the moment. And lastly, I'll do a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can buy a node, even if you're based in the US. Let's jump into this video. Right, before I talk about the node sale itself and how you can get access to purchase one, I'll do a quick brief overview on what Huddle01 is trying to achieve. Now, Huddle01 is trying to revolutionize the decentralized audio and video connectivity. Think of any audio or video communication platform at the moment, like Zoom or Google Meets, Skype or Teams. All of these have a lot of issues with them that this project is trying to remedy. Current projects have got huge operational costs. There's latencies because of the geographical location, which means that in many countries around the world, if you jump on Zoom or Teams or any of the alternatives, there's actually a lot of lags and latencies. There's no ability to trade crypto. There's no privacy. In fact, there's been a lot of breaches and leaks of privacy from Zoom and other such <laughs> providers. And lastly, all of the value of these current existing platforms are just being retained by the companies themselves. There's no sharing of value amongst the users that are ourselves. And that's what Huddle01 is trying to solve by being a cheaper infrastructure, because they deploy nodes that me and you are gonna buy and deploy around the world, they've got a 95% cheaper rate than any of their competitors. They've also got improved performance. They're totally private with end-to-end -end privacy. And the most important thing is that there's a bottom-up economy, which means that we have the ability to earn by supporting this project, which means that there is an incentive for this to grow. And that's the deep in aspect of this project. Think of it as Zoom and Google Meets, Skype or Microsoft Teams, meeting Web3. The opportunities that they have is endless. And the project is currently already up and running with 40,000 users on the Huddle One platform, 9,000 users on their Farcaster Audio Spaces platform, and they've got over 35 partners for the software development kits, which means that people from Unity or some of these other projects can simply download the software and implement it through APIs and other such models. They've raised over five and a half million dollars from these awesome funding bodies. They're part of the NVIDIA Inception program. They've got over 130,000 community members and over 160,000 total meetings that they've held so far. So they've got an existing product and an awesome community. And they've got a fully doxxed team. And as we know, that's super important when trying to look into the credibility of any of these projects. That's kind of a short breakdown on what Huddle01 is. I did do an in-depth video on this project. I'll link that in the top right and also the description. So feel free to watch that after you watch this video. So let's move on to the next so let's move on to the next part of this video, the media nodes. Now the media nodes are going to run the infrastructure for this campaign. They allowed you to provide your bandwidth by running these nodes either on your own PC or to a node as a service provider and you earn the huddle token. In return, the project then consumes that bandwidth and users pay for the services and you get the rewards as a result of it. It's a super easy and simple to understand process. The minimum system requirements are four cores, 50 megabytes of minimum bandwidth. Obviously, the more bandwidth you have, the more you're going to earn. You can go up to eight cores as well. And the node itself has a 21%. And the awesome thing about these nodes is that you earn five huddle per day per node. And you can see from the roadmap that TGE, the token generation event, is expected around quarter one of 2025. And here you can have a look at the tokenomics showing that 21% is going to go towards node holders. Now running the node itself, you can either use a node as a service provider, node ops, ease flow, node terminal, or any of these on the screen. If you use node ops, I've got the link passive CM that gives you a discount when you're running those nodes. And you can also run them yourself on your own PC if you've got the ability and the bandwidth to run them. Now they've got a bit of an offer on at the moment. If you get five nodes, you get one free. If you get 10, you get two free. If you buy 50 nodes, you can get three free. And the pricing is done through a tiered model with tier one being the cheapest around $320. And then the price increases by 10% as we go on. Payments are made in wrapped Ethereum on the Arbitrum chain. Let's quickly jump into the next part of the video when I show you how you can purchase 
one of these nodes. Now, first things first, you're going to want to make sure that you've got the Arbitrum chain selected on your MetaMask wallet. You can select it from the list here. If not, you can just click Add Network and search for Arbitrum 1. Now, you're going to want to make sure that you've got some Ethereum on Arbitrum 1. That's what you're going to swap to wrapped Ethereum when you want to purchase this product. Once you've got that in your wallet, you simply click Swap. And then you're going to choose the Ethereum that you have and you're going to swap it for wrapped Ether. As you can see, I've got some here. And you're going to want to choose the amount which corresponds to how much you're purchasing for your node. Now that's all done. I've got wrapped Ethereum on the Arbitrum chain in my wallet. Let's go ahead to purchase this. Now you're going to click the link in the description. That's going to automatically apply the discount code. If not, the discount code is Passive Crypto. And you just want to click Accept to proceed. Now a few people are concerned because it talks about KYC and there are some countries which are blocked. Now if you live in the USA, you're always going to be blocked to purchase nodes. It's just something that's going to happen when you're in the USA. So either you're not going to be in the node space or you work some workarounds. Now the workaround that most people use is to get something called a Palau ID. Now, Palau is a country. It's the Republic of Palau. This project was co-founded by Ethereum co-founder Vitalik Buterin. So it is a legitimate project. All you do is you apply for one of these IDs. Now, they are a little bit pricey, of course. There are different pricing guides for the different ones that you have. But that will allow you to KYC for any project, any crypto project or exchange or whatever it might be, because it gives you a residency and an ID for a country that's outside of the US, but you still have the ability to to KYC. So that's my recommendation if you live in the US. Simply apply for one of these. You should keep one anyway on your hand because you never know when you'll need it. So make sure that you do that first of all and then you click proceed. And after you click proceed, it's going to ask you to sign into your wallet. So you can just sign into the wallet that you've got so far. Now, once you've signed in, you can choose the tiers. Thankfully, tier one is still available. So we're going to click purchase. You're going to choose the number that you want to apply. And the discount code should be already applied passive crypto. That's going to take 10% off your purchase price, and then you're going to simply click purchase. You're going to approve the spending cap, and then it's going to allow you to approve the transaction. Confirm. And that's it. Congratulations. You've purchased your HODL01 media node. Now, the deployment of these nodes are going to be around two weeks after the sale. I'll do a follow up video showing you how you can deploy those nodes, whether on your own computer or as a node as a service provider. Hopefully, this was a useful video for you to learn how to get hold of these nodes. I am super excited for the potential that this project has because it has a real use case, especially for gaming communities and other communities. But that's it from me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do like videos like this, why not check this one out here? All right, I'll catch you in the next video.